opening up the new 208. I have had what, two or three of these mics now. And people keep borrowing it from me and not giving it back. Let's go. So kind of our workflow is we record in the control room. Uh, artists there, you know, on uh, close to the screen, just like in their element. Like it, a lot of sessions that we do feel like you're in your living room. I think like like a lot of people like when in these situations when you say want to just record in the control room or do something like that, it's 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 easy to think that you know let's grab a, a, a dynamic mic. There's two very popular ones that people tend to gravitate to, uh, and I did I did that for a while, and I, I remember talking to a friend of mine, Bryson, and I was like, yo, I need something that has a little more, like like a condenser, you know, just just a, a little more detail on top because it, it just it just sounds like, I don't want to say that it sounds like this, but, you know, it kind of it kind of has that, 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 that effect. And the reason that the, you can get away with doing this is one, it's top address. Uh, unlike uh, a lot of microphones, other microphones, and because of that, or not, however it's designed, I don't know because of that or what, but it, 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 anything that comes in from the side, it rejects. Uh, so you can get very directional. You can get a really clear, good, decent signal um, without it picking up extra stuff in the room or extra noise. Uh, and that, that's why this is like my go-to mic when it comes to recording in the control room. Um, the time that I really started using this a lot was... Thug really likes playing video games and he used to be sitting at the back of the room and he wanted to just hold a mic. Like he, it, it, it brings out a different kind of performance in him when he's just sitting and holding the microphone. Um, and that's when this this guy really uh, came in handy because, you know, like the, the rejection, it, it, it blocks all the extra noise. Uh, it's, it is a condenser mic, so it's still got the fidelity that I need and I'm used to. And because of the rejection, there's not much noise. So I can, in the box, uh, or one, I mean, once I'm mixing it, I can do whatever I need to do to bring back that 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 extra top end or sheen or whatever after it's been cleaned up. Uh, yeah, there's like uh, there there've been times where he like literally just leaves the mic like this on him while he's playing uh, the video game, and like a lot of what he does is when he's creating, he disconnects from everything else, and he's just like he doesn't want to be focused on. Because it does bring out a different problems. There's, there's times where he's literally like holding this, falling asleep, and like he's got the beat playing. It just literally says says things, and then I'm sitting like in front of the room, and I like know which ones to take and like put it all together. Uh, but yeah, this this mic has like been on a bunch of records that we've done, and like it's usually the ones that have that are like slower, like more emotional, have like stories and stuff. Uh, yeah, we did. Um, uh, we did a bunch of records with with Andrew Watt and uh, Louis Bell, and ended up using this this for like the, the we you know the ones where he sat up front it was it was uh, Eden or something like that, but um, when he like kind of wanted to you know just get in the zone and I'd say like it's it's basically like when the, the when you want to use a di a dynamic mic in the in the room or like they say maybe you want to record but have the speakers on as well which you know. Why do they want to do that? Because they're artists. That's that's you know it's a vibe. It's a vibe thing. Um, artists like don't 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 think like engineers do, and engineers don't think like artists do, and that's why everyone has their own role. So yeah, like there's a bunch of a bunch of the records that I've used this on. I've actually like made cuts on albums. There's um, a few on Slime Language. Uh, off the top of my head, we used it on um, Liddy. Uh, it's a song with Thug and the Baby. Um, there was two people in the room, obviously DaBaby and Thug recorded together, so Thug just held this, and DaBaby used the other mic in the room. And then uh, there's a song called Mop, with Thug and Gunna, we used this mic on that as well. Um, and um, yeah, a, a few more on, on, on Thug's last album, more, actually more on Thug's last album as well. Um, and yeah, it's just like, there's a lot of times when, you know, they're, 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 there's, a, there's a few records that it's on, some unreleased ones that are, are really, really big ones with, with some other pretty cool artists that I can't really say yet. Uh, but uh, when, when they're out, we'll definitely talk about it. <laughs> so when, when when the artist says they want to they, they want to hold a mic in their hand and they want to sit at the back of the room and, you know, just because they've seen people do it with, with dynamic mics in the past, and if I hand them this, they're not going to question it because they know that 
I'm like I'm making whatever they want happen, but doing it at the highest possible level of fidelity available to me. Um, you know, give, given these situations, and that's what engineering is. It's 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 working with imperfect situations and and figuring out the best possible solution. A lot of times, you don't have a perfect environment, and when it is really sterile, the creativity is lost. You know, and that is that's the most important thing. You know, uh, the records, the how 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 good it sounds or whatever, usually comes second. People, if a good song is a good song, uh, it's our job to make that sound good. And that's why I like the Latin 208.